Hello, I'm Harlan. Now in the twinkling of an eye, we'll be changed. This is a mystery, and I want to tell you the mystery of the catching away, they call it. It's a, the Bible people call it the rapture. I want to tell you this for Holy Ghost people. Now you know in Adam, everybody dies. But in Christ, the second man Adam, we're all made alive. And he'll change our vile body. It'll be fashioned like his glorious body, according to the working whereby he is able to subdue all things to himself. Now you're living in the last days. You're living in the feet where the clay and the iron all comes together. All these kingdoms now have come together, and they're one. There's about 200 nations on earth, and that's the condition the earth will be in when Jesus returns. There's not going to be no great antichrist sitting in the temple of God. The Pope sits in the temple of God. King sits in palaces, and that's where they're, they rule from. And they've got nuclear powers. Nobody's going to take their country from them. Not one man from a country is going to rule them. Now the Pope rules through the spiritual man. So he sits in the temple of God. So this is all happening. Now, what I want to tell you Holy Ghost people, watch for things to happen on the earth. And the ones that are alive and remain, if we're here when he comes back, they'll be caught up together to be with the, in the clouds. You'll be caught out, and I'm going to show you how that works. Now listen to me how it works. It's so simple. I have been like sitting here like this praying, and I would just fall out boom, into the Spirit, and I'd see heaven open up, and Jesus would speak to me from heaven. That's moving. You'll be changed. You'll be changed from a fleshly body to a spiritual body. Now, I had my tent up one time in, in Texas, and these men were standing under the tent, and they was talking about the rapture and all, Bible worshipers, you know, I was trying to tell them uh, about the Holy Ghost. And they said, let's move outside the tent here. You know, when if uh, Jesus comes back, we won't have to go up through this tent. You know, see, they think they're going to heaven in their flesh. Flesh and blood will not inherit the kingdom of God. So remember this. You'll be changed. All of a sudden, you'll drop the flesh. And then you'll be caught away in the spirit to be with the Lord in the air. The dead in Christ arise first. Now you'll be at the last trump. So this is for you Holy Ghost people. And you know, you've seen pictures of these Bible people showing traffic jams and ever cause everybody was taken to heaven. That's a lie. Then there'll be enough of us to when we leave, it ain't going to harm the earth at all. Because there's so few Holy Ghost people, and that's the only ones that's going. And so, pay close attention to this. Now, there are seven churches, there are seven seals, and there are seven trumpets. Now, we'll be here when the trumpets blow. Now, watch, God is angry at the earth. You notice all the tsunamis and all the earthquakes and the fires and the droughts and the floods and tornadoes and, and volcanoes. He's angry. God is angry. My Holy Father is angry at the earth. The Heavenly Father is going to bring destruction. See, there's people on every corner of the earth now. There's 7 billion people on the earth. So pretty soon, He's going to do some things on the earth when these trumpets blow. At the last, when Jesus opens the last seal, the trumpets blow. Now we're leaving at the last trump. You'll be here for a lot of trouble. There'll be a lot of tribulation. But you just stay in the Holy Ghost and stay clear of Bible worshipers. And just let God keep you by the Holy Ghost. And then you'll have a wonderful, wonderful time going to heaven. And it'll be worth it all. Now, I know you have a hard time here, you Holy Ghost people. Nobody don't want you. They don't like you. They don't love you. But I've made it. And this is my golden anniversary with Jesus. I've been in it 50 years now. So he touched me in the springtime in 1964. And it's by his grace he delivered me. And you'll be caught away now. That's the way it'll happen. You'll be changed from flesh to spirit and you'll be called away with Jesus in the air, and you'll forever be with the Lord. He'll gather us together. This is a mystery, and this will happen. But there'll be some happenings when the trumpets is blowing. And then in the middle of Revelations, you've got the little book. The people that eat the little book, their bellies, out of their bellies are going to flow rivers of, li of bitter water. Out of our bellies is going to flow rivers of living water. So I wanted you to know about the rapture, how it's going to be, and the truth about it. And... Rejoice in that. When the devil gets on to you and you can't hardly make it, think about being caught away. You're going to be caught away out of your body and you're going home and you'll forever be with Jesus and he'll give you a new body and you'll live on a new earth forever. And I'm going to look for you there, all you Holy Ghost people. I'll come and 
Ask, is any out of my dispensation of time here? And I'll be glad to see you when we all get home.